quick review for you guys. I'm really excited because this little bad boy on my head is a very popular unit on YouTube, so I thought, hey, I definitely gotta review it. But um, it is a half wig. It is a yakky texture, very thick, almost like African American hair if you were to blow dry it straight. It has that kind of texture, which is awesome. Um, it makes for really easy blending because of the more coarse yakky texture, and I really love it. I wore this unit out yesterday to a brunch day party in the city, and I got so many compliments on it. So this is definitely, definitely a great unit um, for people that are looking for something quick and easy. Um, so the name of the unit is Outre Quick Weave, and it is a half wig. It, you can style it in 60 seconds, that's what the label says. And I got it in the color 1B. So that's what the label looks like. And this unit is so nice. Like, I, I cannot tell you how many compliments I got on it yesterday when I wore it outside. And what I love is that I can blend my edges in. So when the wind blows, it literally looks like it's my own hair. Um, it's really light on the head. It's really, really soft. Um, in terms of tangling, I didn't get too much tangling yesterday, but I did notice that as the night progressed, it did get a little bit tangled in the nape of the neck. I think that might be attributed to the fact that it was really hot yesterday, so I was sweating and moving around and dancing, so I would just assume that the back of, you know, the hair that's in the back of my neck would start to get a little bit tangled. But it wasn't that big a deal. It didn't look like a rat's nest or anything, so, um, the tangling, or the tangling was to a minimum. It wasn't like extreme, extreme. In terms of shedding, I didn't get much shedding either. I did just brush it out and there are some hairs in here, but that's also because yesterday when I got home, it was kind of tangled. I didn't brush it out. I just brushed it before I started filming now. So I did get a few hairs, but it's nothing super crazy. It's not like shedding hair, you know, in bunches. So that's a good thing as well. Um, again, it's really, really soft. I think it's a really good length too. It's not too long and it's not too short. I think this is a very realistic length for it. Um, someone that's looking to um, wear like a half wig and have it look really decent and real. So I'll just pull all the hair to the front so you guys can see. I think it's roughly about 18 inches, 20 at the most, but I'd, I'd lean more towards 18 inches. So this is... Um, where it falls on me, which is toward in like my probably like right underneath my boobs. And um, all I did to blend my hair, I'll just get up a little bit close so you guys can see. Um, all I did was I blow I blow, blow dried my hair, and then I took a, my flat iron and I flat ironed the pieces, and then I have a little um, edge wand, which I think I'll show you guys. Just hold on a second. This, I use this little tool, which is, it's like a modern day hot comb. It's awesome. Um, basically what I do is I'll flatten my edges, like the roots, the hard, because you know, the places that are hard to get with a flat iron, like when you usually flat iron your hair, it's really, really difficult to get really close to the root of the hair and get it straight. So that's when this tool comes in handy. So after I flat iron, I'll go back in and use this and um, get really close to the edges. And it's good because it has this, these little guards around the, I don't know what you call this. <laughs> Why am I having a brain fart? I guess you call it like the rod, like the heated rod. There's like this little guard here that keeps you from burning yourself. So when I put it here, the, these pieces touch the skin and the rod doesn't touch your skin so you don't get burned like you would with like an old fashioned hot comb that you would heat on the stove. So that's why I use this and I've, I've had it for say almost two years and it's one of the best purchases I've made. So if, if you're looking to like straighten your roots and get really close to them, I would definitely recommend this. This brand is called Root Ease by, I hope I don't butcher the name, Teich or Teiche, I'm not even sure, but I'm going to put it to the camera so you guys can see. I hope it focuses. There you go. Yeah. So that's the brand. And it's really good, um, and it's really cheap. I think I paid roughly around $25 for it from, well, when I bought it. It, it might have gone up a little bit, but I think this is a really, really good investment for um, girls who are looking to kind of get the, the, root, the root of your edges really, really sleek and straight. 
So yes, I definitely recommend this. Um, yeah, I'll straighten my hair out. I'll use the root ease um, to get close to the root. And then I put like a head tie around my edges just for like five minutes to get them really flat. And then I took it off, put the wig on and then just combed my hair over it. And then I, you know, you can um, take out more of your edges. Oh, I forgot to mention, I'm, I'm on camera with no makeup. I decided I, I wasn't in the mood to put on any makeup. I had worn makeup yesterday, and the thing is, is that this weekend has been really, really hot, so I just didn't want to put a boatload of makeup on my face and just have it melting, and it's kind of gross, so I just avoided makeup altogether, so I'm bare face today. I'll link down the site that I got it from. It was, when I purchased it, it was roughly $14. I mean, you can't beat that. $14 for a wig is insane, you know, and a very realistic looking wig at that. Um, I think you're getting a lot of bang for your buck with this wig, and I think this will get a lot of longevity. Like, you'll be able to wear it for a long time because of the texture of it. It's just really, really realistic, really, really soft. Yeah, so I love how this wig just blends in so seamlessly. It just looks like my real hair, and that's what I love about it. It just looks so realistic. Um, the price is awesome, 14 bucks. You can't beat that, right? And I just think that you'll get a lot of longevity and use out of this wig because it looks so realistic and because it has that yakky texture. You're not going to find that with a lot of wigs. I, I don't see a lot of wigs that look like this and look this natural, especially synthetic wigs. So this is definitely a great purchase, and I recommend anyone looking for like a half wig or hasn't ever done a half wig before because this is my first half wig that I've ever worn and um, what I liked about it and why I chose to get this half wig was because I could easily blend my, my hair because my hair is very very coarse all right it is coarse honey like coarse um, let me just get up close so you guys can see this is my hair on the front it's not as blended today as it was yesterday as I was rushing to you know film this so I kind of just flat ironed my the hair in front real quick so it's not perfect but trust me my hair was super blended yesterday and looked absolutely fabulous so yeah I just wanted to rush and get on here but my edges are out from ear to ear so all of my edges are out from ear to ear and I just put the, the half wig right behind it so that's how I was able to blend this in. Yes, darling, I love it. Oh, I should probably give you guys like a 360. So this is what it looks like. And then this way. And so you guys can see. So yeah, I absolutely love it. So, yeah, that's it. The wig is Outre Annie. In a color 1b it comes in a lot of other colors that they list on the bottom so yeah this is an awesome unit and i will catch you guys in the next video bye